guys, it's Sassy Cassie, and welcome back to another reaction video of Naruto. As always, I'd like to thank all of my subscribers and anyone watching this video. Thank you guys so much for following me on my shinobi journey. Secondly, as a reminder that even though I've been an anime fan for a very long time, I have never watched Naruto. However, because it's been out for so long because of the internet and because one of my best friends' favorite anime is Naruto, there are just some things about Naruto that I already know. This is mostly like character names and maybe what they look like no real major plot points. It has come to my attention, however, that I may know more than I think I know, but I don't know what these things are until they come up in the show. So, I apologize in advance if that bothers anybody, but we are just going to keep watching Naruto and enjoying it to the fullest. All right, so last time on Naruto, we got a little filler in between Neji and Naruto's fight and this next fight, which is Shikamaru versus Tamati. I mean, it wasn't really filler because we got to find out what actually happened um, so that Neji's, like, anger could, like... He could finally, like, move past it in a sense. And then, on the other hand, we have the Sand Village and their plan with the Sound Village and what they're hoping to do, but whatever it is caused a bunch of skipping forward well initially Sasuke not showing up caused everything to be pushed forward and all that stuff so we don't know what's going on but all we know is that Shikamaru and Tamari are gonna fight and I know that some of you are excited about this fight my best friend originally wanted to watch this with me she was really hoping that I would watch it faster as I have been told by multiple people that they wish that I could do this a little more often Trust me, I would rather be watching this than doing all of my homework, but alas, I chose to be responsible. <laughs> Putting that aside, we did finally make it to this episode, so let's get into it. Oh, almost forgot Rock Lee! The birds are chirping, the sky is blue. <laughs> Oh yeah, she come out and got knocked off the railing. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Pretty music. But Naruto has that smile. He has like complete faith in Shikamaru and Shikamaru's not about it. <laughs> Cloud Envy. They're throwing trash? What is this? Oh my gosh, I feel like a classic theater show. Oh, show them wrong. Or show them up. Show them that they're wrong. Hmm. Giving up two. And to top it off, my opponent's a girl again. Ah, <laughs> oh, Shikamaru. It'll be fine. He never was very driven, but this. Gather, Shikamaru! You've got to get going sometime this year! The booing just has me. Hey, I didn't start the match yet. I forgot. This girl's a spunky one. Spunky. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It really doesn't make a whole lot of difference to me whether I ever become a chunin or not. But I guess maybe I shouldn't let myself get beaten by a female. Oh no. You are so cool for that one moment. <laughs> He's quick enough when it comes to running away. <laughs> I know it's not very classy. 
class for a guy to clobber a girl. Oh my gosh. I was classy. <laughs> Just the way he says classy. He's trying to lure me into the shadow of that tree. I'm not falling for that. Why do I feel like he's got something up his sleeve? Oh my gosh, you know, calm down. <laughs> Seat taken. Oh, Choji. Your stomach's okay now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, obviously he's eating his potato chips. He brought a whole bag of snacks. <laughs> oh, that's literally me. Shikamaru may not have as much fighting spirit as some other people. And okay, his technique is pretty lousy, but he's strong at strategy. So strong, in fact. That without him, we might not have gotten through the preliminary round. Oh, maybe. What's mm. more, you should have seen how he threw himself into the arena. <laughs> he didn't do that on purpose. I think he's going to show us his passionate side today. Uh. Yeah, go, <laughs> you know, I forgot for a second that, you know, cut her hair. Sometimes I wish I was a cloud. Just floating around. Okay. Going wherever the breeze takes me. That's fair. That's my just not into putting effort into stuff. The only reason I became a ninja was so I could do whatever I wanted. Don't you have to follow orders when you're a ninja? <sighs> I have questions. Get your butt in gear! Let's go, Shikamaru! Don't you see what he's doing? <sighs> Yikes. Oh, <laughs> just out of that tree. I remember. This is how she beat me in our fight. Nothing I threw at her could get past it. Yeah, but shadows can't be cut, right? <laughs> Even using the wall's shadow, his jutsu can only reach to here. 15 meters, 32 centimeters. That's you just measured that looking at it? Just stay outside this line. He can't touch me. Yeah, but doesn't the sun, like, move, which change the shadow's length? It's better at long-range attacks anyway. <laughs> this match is as good as over. Looking at the clouds again, my dude. What you doing? Is that a hand sign? No, he's not making a hand sign. It's something more like a habit. A habit? Habit. Like a kid. He's like an old man. He likes to take things slowly. <laughs> I mean, really slowly. He does have a spirit. Whenever he gets stuck in a mood, he does that thing with his hand. Alright. So it's like his way of concentrating? He's working on a strategy. Oh. Huh? All the times we've played, I've never beaten him. <laughs> so it's not that he's lazy, he just doesn't like to do things super quickly. Strategy on a game board no different from strategy on the field of battle and all great that's generals true know that. shikamaru's got the mind of a great general just you watch you could have fooled me <laughs> forget i saw the test scores when we grouped the gen league his were no better than naruto's maybe worse oh act of putting pencil to paper is a drag it's too much work for him oh He'd rather take a nap than a written exam he would huh? that's it you know some people just don't test well I didn't say he wasn't lazy, but he was so good at strategy games, I had him take an IQ test. <gasps> oh. I had to deceive him into thinking it was just another game. That's funny. Well, what happened? Hmm. Flying colors? He 
his score was almost off the charts. Beyond genius, the kid has an IQ of over 200. You know, that actually is proven that sometimes people that are super, super smart, they just seem like lazy. Their brain just doesn't think the same. So you have some fighting spirit after all. <laughs> I don't think that's his plan. Or he's using the tree to prevent himself from being blown back. I hope so. <laughs> Choji, littering is not good. Don't do that. This is way too much work for him. What are you talking about? No way he's going to give up. At least, I don't think he's going to give up. I think they both know, like two sides of him. The one that's like, nah, nah, give it up, and the other one's just like, nah, that's too much work for me. <laughs> Serious imagery overlaid by Choji's chewing. I'm gonna go with my theory. Now I see what you've been up to. You weren't just hiding. You were killing time, waiting for the sun to get lower. Ha! Ah, I knew it. I knew it. Ha ha ha. And technically, there's no time limit on this battle. How's Skamaru gonna use his shadow anyway? I mean, what's he gonna do? He's in the shadow of the arena already. Unbelievable. You really don't know anything about what Shikamaru's capable of, do you? He oh, he's too busy he can even eating. Make shadows within shadows. That's fair. He is only utilizing his shadow and not the shadow of other things. If I just calculate the height of the sun and measuring the distance he's gained from his previous attack, I can still keep out of range. No problem. Hmm. <laughs> Why do I feel like it's not going to be that easy? Is that even allowed? <laughs> That's why he took off his shirt. Understanding. Clever move. Now I not only have to worry about the shadows on the ground, I have to keep an eye on this thing above my head, and it extends his range indefinitely. Huh. Guess I've been underestimating this slacker clown. His shadow possession jutsu is a lot more dangerous than I thought. Obviously. <laughs> she learns fast, I'll give her that. <laughs> she thinks in the same way he does. She's a strategist too. Interesting. I wonder if they become friends later. I create a diversion with the clone jutsu. <laughs> yeah, that'll work. Will it though? No. Clone jutsu. Huh? What? My body, it's frozen. Oh, Shikamaru, you clever, clever fool. How the hell did he do that? Amazing. He was thinking three moves ahead all along. As I said, that's Shikamaru's strength. Impossible. How could okay, but how did he get her? Did he go around the other way? <laughs> Look behind you. I'll let you. <laughs> oh, I'll let you. Oh, the hole! Out of the hole. Ha! Wow. Now I see. 
I never thought of the shadows underground. That was your mistake. Ah. <laughs> like I said he's thinking three moves ahead. That's cool. I, I don't believe it. The whole time I thought I was keeping out of range of the shadow jutsu when I was really walking right into it. Amazing. This slacker clown outsmarted me. I mean, only a slacker in some sense. Oh, Konkuro does not look happy. A minute ago they were throwing things at him. Yeah, well, he showed them. Oh my gosh, this music is making my heart beat so fast. <laughs> Somebody say something. <laughs> the hell with it. I give up. What? <laughs> okay. Looks like I know Shimaru a little bit better than you do, huh? What? What did you say? Seriously, explain. Out the next 200 moves in my head, but my chakra is running low. Anyway, if I was to win this thing, it would just mean more work. <laughs> Shikamaru, seriously? The winner is Tamari. I'm waiting for it. Where's your signature line? He's not gonna say it. Uh okay, fine. Okay, um, <laughs> it was a good fight, in a sense. I'm so, I'm not, like, upset, because I should have realized. I also think it's kind of cool that Shikamaru, like, plans, like, he just thinks differently. And I'm... <sighs> I laugh because after watching this episode, I 100% completely understand why my best friend loves him so much. She is the kind of person that... Oh, how do I explain? So, we both really love watching Criminal Minds. And she also, I should say, really loves, like, psychology and things like that. And understanding that, like, people who are geniuses how they think differently that's always been her type of character the smart character the yeah just that kind of character she i yeah i get it like knowing watching this episode i understand now <laughs> but i don't know i just think it was so cool that he really did think everything through thought everything out in advance that he like he was saying he had planned out the next 200 moves and then he but i and on the one hand, I am, like, disappointed that he ended up not winning the match. Because I'm curious if this will make the Sand Village plan go smoother. Because she's still in it. I don't know. But I also think that it's important to know what your limits are. Well, as as cheesy as that sounds, sometimes... We tend to push ourselves, like, in, whether you're a ninja or whether you're just living your life, you tend to push yourself, and you don't stop at your limit. So, luckily, this wasn't, like, a actual life-or-death situation, but knowing that he was out of chakra and knowing that he could have won, but that he just didn't have the capability, so he's like, I quit. Um... I think in a sense it's kind of good. Still upset that he lost, but I also think that he's got, he really does, he's got a good head on his shoulders. So I was still waiting for him at the end to say what a drag, but I mean, I guess in a sense he did because he was like, yeah, besides if I kept going, like I would still have to do stuff and that's just a lot of work. 
I do also think it's interesting that he said that he wanted to become a ninja so he could do whatever he wanted. But I have questions about that because I didn't think ninja or shinobi got to do whatever they want. I thought they had to like carry out missions and stuff. So I don't know. There's still a lot about the shinobi world that I don't know. So we'll see. In the meantime, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and following me on this crazy shinobi journey. And until next time, bye.